Good afternoon, all you wood trimmers. Paul Crabtree from Crabtree Hollow. Staying with the grain, doing the best I can. In this uh, little short video, I just wanted to update you folks on King 5. Uh, we went on a trip for about five weeks, and so I, I put King 5 in a garbage can full of chips, filled it full of chips and everything, put it in there. I haven't looked at it, haven't touched it yet. I've been very anxious to. So I thought I'd share with you on, okay, much to my surprise, I can see a little bit of uh, King 5 sticking out. Now these chips are feeling pretty dry up here on top. They were uh, pretty damp when I put it in here. So let's just pull this out and uh, see what we have here. It has a, a somewhat of a moldy smell to it, uh, which I can imagine would normal would being submerged in this for so long without being changed. What I do like about it is it's still nice and round. It hasn't uh, moved like the pieces I put into the oven. So let's uh, get a moisture meter here. Moisture meter meter here is right around uh, let's say 16. Okay, down here you're having about 26. Here. Uh, it's going crazy. About 31 down there. 29 there. Okay, so so it hasn't dried significantly. And uh, what I really like about it is I went off and left it and it looks about the same <laughs> now that I'm back. So I'll uh, I'll put it in uh, bags from now on and uh, finish drying it the way that I know how to dry it. Yeah, it should come out just fine. Well, from the looks of it, I would think that we have about another oh month and a half or so left for drying on King Five, uh, and. Uh, just go from there. Uh, I am surprised that uh, the chips didn't take more moisture out of it in that length of time. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please subscribe.